Hello scapers, how are you all doing this fine day? Two days ago I achieved my goal of 1000 rot skills 191 days after the release of boss kill counters on the same day as Araxel. I also had a goal of achieving 120 defense at the same time which unfortunately I didn't get because I got it on the 1001 to kill rather than the 1000th kill. Well, because of Shadow Realm giving me an XP drop of 2.5k rather than 20k, which I was expecting. But never mind, I got the 1000 kills, guys. I guess this is loot from 1002 kills to be exact, because that's how much I had to get, how much I got before I price checked everything. And it's been a hell of a journey, guys. It really has been. Um, I encourage you to look at my loot from 500 rots video, uh, which I did obviously when I reached 500 about two months ago and the reason I say that is because most of the action and excitement happened at that time um, I was very lucky back in back at that time with shields and I was not so lucky at, uh, now compared to before uh, for example I had a dry streak around 300 kills where I probably got one shield or maybe no shields but compared that to before I got 500 kills I got four shields in a single day and I've seen loads of back-to-back -back shields and double shield chests around five I would say uh, not all of them for me but I've seen plenty of that and it's been a load of fun guys uh, I started in September just after the update of the Shadow Run and uh, I believe that was the best thing they could have done to Rots it made it so much less trollier but also harder I guess if you didn't kill Carol first because if you don't kill Carol first any shadow realms any lightnings you're pretty much screwed so that was the only problem but I apart from that I love the update they did to rots but on the other hand I have to say I'm probably done around 1500 attempts I I guess uh, for 1000 kills because if you start failing and you're having a bad day this is one of those bosses where you just keep failing um, you don't really get better un until you leave and then take a break and come back and things sort of start to click with your team I guess so it's one of those bosses unfortunately at least for me I don't always go with the best teams but when I do things go really well uh, for example I just a few days ago I had a, a 11 energy trip which is the most I've had 5.1 mil or something that trip that trip took about 20 minutes so it was a really good trip and you can you can have those kinds of trips but also you can have trips where you get say one kill in a one hour period so it's it's a bit of a roller coaster but it's a really fun boss i encourage you to do it i'm glad i finished it because it was one of my goals for the path to the pronus video uh series that i'm doing uh one of the goals well two of the goals are to get 120 defense and 1k rot skills i completed two of them just two more to go now so i encourage you to see that as well and yeah i'd just like to say thank you to everyone that supported me i guess you're all looking forward to seeing the loot so it won't take too too much longer it's especially thank you to those guys who were there for my 1000th rot skill so Canman, aaron lucas and truly gothic so thank you very much guys i've been dying to sell this loot tab for ages guys because it's just been building up in my bank and it's worth so much that you know i just want i really want to see how much it sells for so here we go guys i'm telling you now go to the g spam by tier 90 shields get your adrenaline up to 100 percent, and then barricade because you're gonna need it i'm gonna bring a massive rain of uh coins I guess lots and lots and lots and lots of coins on you because that's what I'm gonna get from selling all this stuff now um, in my loot from 500 rots video um, I showed that I had 15 shields in this one I have 21 that basically means in the first 15 uh, first 500 kills I got 15 shields in the next 500 I got six which is quite skewed I guess uh, but I'll take it at, um, 21 shields isn't too bad and uh, that's 9 plus 10 as well for you guys that didn't know much but yeah jokes aside guys the loot is pretty good as you can see uh, it's almost at 1.5k energy so the average of 1.5 energies per successful kill holds true I did obviously well not obviously but I did have to lobby a few times because of getting stuck in the tunnels after getting my energy and also because my teammates left me 
when I had to AFK, like what happened yesterday. But yeah, guys, let's just PC this. I'm I'm expecting the energies to be the biggest chunk. Uh, in the in the previous loot video, I got 495 mil from 500 kills. Let's see if I can get up to one bill from 1,000. Oh, unfortunately not. I kind of expected it. Things have been crashing recently. I'm hoping um, some of the supplies like black dehyde, uh, magic seeds, and what else? Rock rock tails. They hopefully rise because of double XP weekend, and I would, I will make a bit more than I anticipated. But what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna insta sell all these because that will just, um, you know, I won't get the max amount of money that I can from that. So what I did, I insta bought one of each of the main ones. So as you can see here, these are the costs. Uh, I'm going to put them in for just under this, so basically maximizing my profits and um, make sure that I don't sell it instantly. So it'll take like a few hours up to a few days maybe uh, to do this, so that's why I haven't brought out the video straight after getting the uh, getting this achie achievement. So yeah, I'm going to do that now. And uh, before I go, let me keepsake this amazing 120 death cape guys if you didn't know I got this on my 1001st rot skill I was meant to get it on my 1000th but Shadow Realm um, decreased my XP by tenfold so I didn't get there in time you can see the highlight on our twitch channel but here we go check keepsake how does it work oh damn um, um, um. yes I've keepsake my master cape I am a master of defense now Oh yeah, oh yeah, that looks amazing. Now just for the blue part here. Okay, guys, something I forgot to mention was uh, to do with the drop rate of shield. So in the first 500 I got 15, that's one in 33. Uh, in the next 500 I got six in 500, so that's one in 83. On average, my drop rate for shield is around one in 47. Uh, I have no idea whether that is good or bad but i guess it's average seeing as i've done 1k so that's a reasonably good sample size to base my theory on and also guys um i didn't mention the charms that's probably because it's not worth writing home about um on average you get one charm drop per kill uh, a charm drop comprises of four charms thankfully the blue charms are the most common ones which you would expect for a high level boss and apart from that there's nothing um, especially interesting to know apart from the fact that there's, that's a ton of rock tails and these barrows amulets are so cheap it's almost like a troll drop every time you get them well that experiment with the maximizing my profit certainly paid off i guess it did uh, because it took a while to sell but it eventually all sold i couldn't sell these two items uh, that you can see on screen now i guess the black dehyde and the raw rock tail so I just insta sold them because I got impatient and they didn't sell past just a few um, despite putting them in for two days so I did that and uh, here are the last two things so click number one and this the second click the most significant click in the history of mankind or well, not really in the history of 1000 rot kills kind all those tears from dying, from being, from suicide, tendril suiciding, from being trolled by other people getting back to back shields and me getting nothing, and from not getting 120 defense on the 1000th kill. This is for you. This is for you. Alright, 850 mil, guys. That's lovely. That's really nice. And grats to Aaron on the Visage. Damn, that guy's lucky as hell. Um, <laughs> That is the end of this journey, guys. 1,000 kills done. That doesn't mean I'm going to stop, though. If I get Ross Task, I'll keep doing it. And I have been teaching a lot of people and streaming it on Twitch um, for people that want to learn Ross. So if there are any more people that want to learn, feel free to PM me. I'll be happy to teach, but I won't be as enthusiastic about doing Ross as I was before I reach my goal, because uh, at this point, I've got two new goals. One is to get the Araxi pet, so I need to actually get three pets from from that boss before I can get it. And the second one is to get uh, 500 Viraga kills, um, and I'm 180 dry there. So hopefully I'll get a personal seismic for that as well. So as you can see, 321 Araxi, 
Um, yesterday I got 20 kills without logging, I guess. Uh, 5 kills at 300% in rage. I'll bring out a video about that, which is absolutely insane. Uh, but yeah, I'm going for 500 Varaga, I guess 500 Araxi, but possibly more if it means that I still haven't got my Araxi pet when I get to 500, I'll do some more. And that's about it guys, thank you very much for watching and uh, check out our Twitch and our Twitter. Uh, we post a lot on Twitter now than we used to and we stream a lot on Twitch as well. So I hope it caters for all audiences and we'll see you guys later. Mm -hmm.